it starts with the work. This isn't easy. For some it is. But this is talent, 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 talent. There's people who are so naturally talented at photography, but they have no idea about the other stuff that I'm going to get into with this framework. But they have such natural talent that the work is insane. But it's everything that comes down here that they have no idea about. I spend a lot of time on the work. I spend a lot of time helping you develop the work because without the work, you, we can't go any further. And the funny thing is, the thing that I see the most in this area, it's a hard one to say, but I see lazy work. I see lazy work. That's the thing that like, and I help you, I catch it. I'm like, hey, uh, that picture is kind of out of focus, you know? But as I've shifted my content towards helping pros become pros, because you're a pro already, you just haven't learned the skills in order to make the money yet. There's so much lazy work. There's so much lazy work from photographers that have talent. And then why am I not working? It's like, cause you don't give a shit. Cause guys like me that give a shit, are gonna steamroll you. So many people don't get out of this cycle. They don't get out of this cycle of, they have talent, they create lazy work, they have lazy work. They're like, damn, I'm talented. And they just keep going through cause no one's looking at their work and calling them out on their bullshit. This is what I do. I call you out when you're mailing it in. And I also praise you when you're not. When you are putting every single speck of talent that you have for photography into the photography that you send to me to look at, I praise you. And I also judge you against you. You're not being judged against any other photographer here. You're being judged against you. Um, but you're being motivated by the other amazing photographers in this group. This is the second thing, the second huge package that you're going to learn is packaging. The packaging. The packaging is your portfolio, your website, your branding. And so much more. The most important one, the one that everybody forgets about, the most important part of packaging is you. And many people don't spend any time working on you. None. None. Your health, fitness, and mindset. Those three things, if you don't have those nailed the fuck are you doing excuse my french but like what are you doing there's no future with no health there's no future if you're not healthy your health that's the one thing that derails so many people get derailed because of a health problem because health they didn't give a shit about their health for so long. And then now, oh shit. So guess what? That health is part of your packaging. How people see you is also how they decide. People decide whether they're going to hire you in a second. As soon as they see you, that's the person. Or that's not the person. You, people also forget that when you're on a job, you're being presented also to other people. So you're being presented as like someone's choice. And if you're all sloppy and all messy, then you're making the person that chose you look bad. So part of packaging is you. And too many people miss that. So the second part of my, of my framework is packaging and the portfolio 
comes from the work that comes from up there the website comes from up there the branding comes from brainstorming research seeing what other people are doing seeing what's working and trying to find some sort of identity that is you the branding is part of it but you and your motivation and your desire to do this is so 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 much the next thing that i am going to talk about and the next most important framework is the business the business is where 90 percent of people fail because they're they're uninformed they are uninformed on what it takes to run a business not just a photography business any business they have no idea and guess what me i was there i was there one of my failures is on this spot and this is why in the last few years i mean i've kept it going i've always been able to work and make money and shoot celebrities and all that stuff but my business was bullshit how i was running my business was not right you know what? As I was uninformed. <laughs> I was uninformed. I never learned business in school. Photography school didn't talk about the business. I didn't know anything about the business. I was uninformed. And that was a skill that I didn't even know what I didn't know. I was so uninformed. I had no idea what I didn't know. And now that I'm more informed on the business, well, now I'm talking about LLCs. If you're an American, I'm talking about incorporation or a co. Things like this that protect you, um, make it so you pay less taxes and give you like a sense of security and a sense of distance from your business from it being actually you when it's you it's hard for you to be far enough away to see yourself actually as the business but if you register a corporation you're able to have an overview of how you're performing and you take it a hell of a lot more seriously